So let us understand what is A1C. So A1C is a blood test that measures your average blood sugar levels over the past three months. So it basically gives an overall picture on how a patient is managing his diabetes. So we use this test to diagnose diabetes and also to monitor its treatment. So basically the A1C test measures the percentage of hemoglobin in your blood that is coated with sugar. We call this glycated hemoglobin. And the higher your blood sugar levels are over the last few months, the higher your A1C level will be. So when your A1C is around seven, your average blood sugar is around 154. And the A1C of eight, your average blood sugar is around 183. The A1C of nine, your average blood sugar is around 212. A1C of 10, your average blood sugar is 240. And A1C around 11, your average blood sugar is 269. So I usually recommend a target A1C of less than seven for patients with diabetes. If insulin treatments cause frequent episodes of low blood sugar, then it may be appropriate to increase the target A1C goal to eight. So in cases where a patient has concurrent severe health complications, in that case, a slightly more lax goal of eight is acceptable. However, if you can bring an A1C to less than 5.7 without any side effects from the medications, then that's a perfect goal. So for example, like I had one of my patients whose A1C was 11 and then he lost almost like 25 pounds and now his A1C is like 5.5 without any medications. So this is what I'm talking about. Like the, the, there is no, there's no perfect goal. So basically like if you can attain the normal levels of A1C with the least amount of medications possible without causing side effects, that should be a perfect goal. Okay. I hope this video is helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please post in the comment box below and I'll see you in my next video. Until then, goodbye.